Good morning, this is Stacy from Montana Used Bricks and I have another Lego haul video today. And this one is actually kind of fun. It's a small order. There was only 24 items in 13 lots, but it was a lot of unique parts. I decided that since I had been spending a lot of money on myself getting the parts I needed for my sets, I decided that I would get some parts for my husband's sets <laughs> that he's trying to complete. So there's a lot of fun parts in here. This order was actually really expensive because I had one part that was almost $20. So I also spent quite a bit of money on this order, but I think it'll be worth it. And I think this will be, even though it'll be a little bit short, I think you'll enjoy the stuff that's in here. So this order came from a lot of bricks out of Oregon and this is the second time I've ordered from them so let's get into it so looks like it's well packed which is good because they have that expensive part in there which I was, I'm always worried sending those type of parts <laughs> so I appreciate the extra packing And like I said, there isn't much here, but stuff I, my husband needed and a couple of things for myself, of course, because I'm always going to try to fill out the order as much as possible. So the first thing are the bigger parts. There's a couple of used plates. These are for the Gold City Junction set that I'm going to be reselling. I had to order some parts because the parts I had were all scratched. And these look really good, so I'm happy about that. Wasn't as prepared for this as I thought. It is early in the morning, so you'll have to forgive me. It's like 7 o'clock in the morning. I don't usually do Lego hauls this early. <laughs> the caffeine has not kicked in yet. The cafe corner, I got six bricks for that. And I just mentioned in a video I did yesterday that these were the bricks that I'm needing quite a few of to complete my cafe corner so that's six more that gets me a little bit closer and this part here this is the expensive part this is a $20 part and it goes to the RoboMaster set which I believe is part of the system series that they did in the late 90s and it's a set I'm trying to get the parts for to give to my son I'm happy they had this. It's in excellent condition. There's not any scratches on that. That is awesome. So, the one dark blue part is for my cafe corner. And we have a bunch of little parts left. So, these three here, I keep thinking I'm done with my fire brigade, but I needed these specific clips because they're a little bit different than the alternate and I wasn't able to use the alternate on it so I wanted to make sure that I got the original parts. So these are actually going toward my fire brigade. And I still think I'm missing one part for that fire brigade but it didn't affect the build so it's complete except for that one part. <laughs> this here, this dark red with gold statue pattern is for my husband's Venator class Republic attack cruiser. And that is completely built. I don't know what happened because we actually had the stickers for it and that was the whole reason we decided to build it. But when he went to build it, we realized we don't have any of the sticker parts. So I don't know what happened to him if they somehow got put into inventory and sold. But even though it's built, we still need to get all the stickered parts for it. So this will be going toward his Venator Class Republic Cruiser. So, so that's one for my husband. <laughs> These light gray parts are also... Oh, no, these are light bluish gray parts. Sorry. Um, one of these will go toward my cafe corner and the other three will go toward the green grocer. This, believe it or not, was the whole reason I went into 
his store was that my husband, this is the very last part he needed for his ghost train. Again, he was able to build it, but it wasn't 100% complete. This was the last part that he needed for that. So that will finally complete his ghost train. And this was the part that brought me into his store. And then once I saw he had all these other parts, I went a little bit overboard. <laughs> this dark azure kid legs is for one of his collectibles. It's for collectible 21 2, which is the kid with violin. Like I said, these were kind of fun. When looking them up to see what they were for, it was a lot of fun for me. These dark bluish hips with dark purple legs is for the space alien from series 3. This hat that says pizza on it is for the pizza delivery guy from series 12. And these two here, this was another really expensive part and I've seen it in a lot of stores but I just never broke down and bought it <laughs> until now because this is a seven dollar part for a collectible. It's bagpipes for the bagpiper from series seven and he's had this on his list for a really long time so hopefully he'll be happy that he gets this. I told him I was ordering a bunch of parts for his collectibles but I didn't tell him which parts he was getting. <laughs> And then this last part is for the Space Miner from Series 12. So that should complete that collectible for him. So like I said, this was a short order. There wasn't a whole lot to it, but it was parts that we needed. And I know that these parts here are going to make my husband really happy <laughs> because it'll complete some of his collectibles and complete a couple of the sets that he has together already. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video. Bye!